Greetings, YouTube. This rank up video is uh, kind of out of nowhere. I told myself the only way I would ever do this was twofold. If I use this champion more than I originally thought I would, and I have. And then the other thing is that because these greater gifting crystals are sort of the opposite of featured cavalier crystals, what I mean by that is that obviously with featured cavs, you only get champions, right? You either get three cha three stars, four stars, or even though they're still not great odds, uh, a much better chance to get five or six star champions than we've ever seen. Uh, what that has done is put this emphasis and this need in the game, uh, supply and demand, if you will, on rank up materials. Tier five, basic, uh, tier two, alpha, and yes, eventually for those of you at the top, tier six, basic, and tier three, alpha. And so, uh, because of the greater gifting crystals, all of a sudden I have all of these tier two alpha. And now as of the last couple of days, not one, but two tier five basic in my overflow. And you need two tier five basic to take a five star to rank five, three tier five basic to take a six star to rank three. And yes, we do have a pesky level up event. Pesky is, is sarcasm by the way. It's, it's great. Uh, so. With that being said, when it comes to my six star champions that I use a lot, I have mutant six stars that I use a ton of. Uh, in fact, the most ranked threes. Namor, Omega Red, Domino, Cable, and Apocalypse are all rank three. And you might be saying, what about Kitty Pride? What about Sunspot? Don't use those as much, even though I'm sure many skilled players do. And so... If I use a six star and I have an opportunity to use a five star as well, sometimes I like to do both. And so this champion has been staying, and I should clear my ISO real quick, by the way. This champion has been staying at rank three for years now, but that changes today because I'm in need of wiping out those resources and at the same time, having some fun. You can see that Domino is SIG 200. She's at 8,534 PI, but that changes right now. And as somebody that already has 565 five stars of both Masakre and Red Hulk, I'm pretty excited about this. Because this also means I have another really fun synergy arena team that I can immediately take into the arena today. And I don't know about you. I know a lot of you watching this may not care about the arena. But I live by it because it's what allows me so much flexibility to open more crystals. And also have a crazy amount of gold. And yes, ISO. So 11,470 is the PI. But of course, we're not stopping there. Because we want to use all of these overflow rank up materials that we got thanks to those greater gifting crystals. And I just have to say, like, Kabam sometimes will do content that you can only bring in two stars, or three stars, or four stars, or five stars. And yes, sometimes there are six star only paths. And so I think if you use a champion every day, you should try to get that champion to max rank no matter what star they are. And Domino is a perfect example of that. Also by taking a 5 star to rank 5 from rank 3, you can see that gets you a crazy amount of level up points. And yes, you do get some cash back if you wait. I told Mr. Danger Darren to wait to take his Hercules to rank five, but he was so gung ho that can't blame you for that in a way. Um, and you'll see the inventory right now, eight tier five basic, 10 tier two alpha, but you go to catalyst, you hit claim and suddenly just like that, 10 tier five basic and 20 tier two alpha. It's like, I never rank them up at all. I also have a uh, slight tick at my first rank four six star. I'm, I'm uh, almost halfway to forming my the tier three alpha needed, but the tier six basic 
is, uh, I believe, lagging a little bit behind. Either way, though, pretty exciting stuff. So, yay! Domino at rank 5 after having my 6-star at rank 3. Always enjoy the Red Hulk, Masakre, Domino, Trinity. If you love a champion, take him to max rank. I don't care if it's a 2-star or a 6-star because you never know what Kabam is going to say the content gates are. And for 2022, you, you have a feeling that's probably going to be the case, so you might as well make the most of it.